Alrighty, hello my friends. This is Cool Cats. It seems to be a platforming game. Uh, just things to note up front. There is no options menu, so hopefully I sound balance everything correctly through my regular sound interface. And the control scheme in the game is uh, interesting. You use the arrow keys. Z is jump, X is your ability, and then you switch your cats with one, two, and three. So it's kind of awkward. So I've gone ahead and I'm using a controller and I've edited all the controls onto my controller and hopefully that's all I need. Oh, I skipped the tutorial. All right, so we have the tutorial here. We'll go through the tutorial and then we'll just go through the rest of the game and uh, just we'll see how it plays. Now, unfortunately, I did not find the space bar to my controller, so I'll just use my keyboard. But you can just move around as normal. Press the Z key to jump. Now you can just press up on the arrow uh, arrow keys to jump as well, but it does not use the special ability of the white cat for whatever reason. So if we go to our white cat here and we just jump at the wall, uh, you can't jump again. But if you press the actual jump key, it acts as a different ability. But then it wants us to destroy this wall and it wants us to use the X key or a uh, square in my case and you have to switch to your other cat. So if we just drop this, it does nothing, because it's a fire cat. So we go ahead and switch to our boomer cat, because I don't know if YouTube allows me to say the B word. And we'll see how it goes. There's water head cats are afraid of water, but not a ninja cat. Okay. Just curious what's up here. Oh, interesting. This is a sheer surface, and you cannot cling to a sheer surface. Now, it does not let you swap to a different cat. If you are currently hanging the wall like this, you can't swap. To swim, hold the Z key. To get out of the water, float to the surface and hold Z at the lid. Okay, you can just press up without pressing the Z. And whenever I say up, I do refer to the up arrow key. Ninja Cat jumps the highest, use a double jump by pressing Z twice when you control the black cat. Hope you can't hear my spacebar, this thing is freaking loud. There's a narrow passage ahead, you choose the red cat. He knows how to crawl, okay? Caution, there's an enemy ahead, this is a chicken susceptible to any attack. You can burn, blow up, or throw a shuriken at the enemy and he will be defeated. We'll go ahead and swap to the fire cat and okay, that goes way far. There we go. Our cat throws a okay. We have an action bar at the top left, which is our cooldown. Gotcha. There's a level exit down there. You need to collect all the keys. Roger. Can I stand on top of it? From above, the enemy is susceptible to fire. Choose the arsonist cat. I wonder what happened if I if I had been in that spot when that happened. Look at that, easy peasy. There's an enemy susceptible to explosives. Only. Okay. Okay, you can cycle through your cats by pressing control. Well, I did not bind that at all, so uh, I'm going to ignore that. Oh, hello. There's more stuff back here. We have one key, but I saw some other keys over here, and I'm curious to see what they are. So I'm gonna go collect all of them. What are you? Ah, okay, so you do need to collect all of them in the tutorial. Gotcha. Okay, so you don't have to spam the Z key, you can just do it kind of gently. And there we go, we passed the tutorial, now we're on to the main stage. Oops, I ran into the enemy and I got him. There we 
go. Can't jump that high, so I'm assuming I do have to go around. There we go. Well, I ain't the best at controllers, so don't mind me if I am terrible. As we saw, there might only be... Oh, but I can... Chuck, how far is that? Here? So fire doesn't seem to hurt you, but, um... Your bombs will. Oh, I said the B word. Don't get angry with YouTube. Oh, I put that in an awkward spot, didn't I? I guess I can just cut my double jump cat home. Maybe I should have made, um, such my cats my triggers. Oh, that would have been smarter. Oh. I have this control scheme and now I'm stuck with it. Because I made them, um, the arrow, the, uh, arrow keys. So I can do this, and then... Yeah, there we go. Yeah, I definitely should have made them the, uh, arrow keys. But, hey, you live and learn, right? I'm not gonna change it now. Oh, he can run into the fire, okay. Already's gonna kill me. Oops, I wanted that berry. I don't know what points are good for, but uh, I'm gonna get the points. I am floating. Wait, there was something down here? Ooh, yanked my camera away at an awkward time there because I almost pressed uh, the other direction. I should really unbind that jump key from my movement stick. Can I actually make it up there without? No, I need that. I need to do the kitty. Yeah, don't mind me if it's sliding all the way down. Um, oh, you can hit these. Yeah, that's gonna get me killed. I should not have bound that key. Actually, give me one second. I'm going to unbind that, because that's gonna get me murdered. Where is my pause button? Here it is. Okie dokie, I'm back. So, I can no longer press up to jump. I have to manually push it. And now I got my... Cats bound to um, the other thing. Oh, actually, one of them is still not working. Oh, it's because that is bound to click for whatever reason. There we go. Okay, so I just gotta get my mouse on the screen. All right, there we go. So don't mind my mouse on the top, top right. Is it still? It's still set to something else. Oh, hello. I just fell on an enemy and died. I just put you at the start again, so that's cool. Oh, I mean, hey. There we go. Okay, so you can actually just put stuff down there. You don't have to worry about it. Now, can this enemy follow me? He can actually just walk past the bomb. Good enough. He's just, he's just chilling there. Okay. Even though I did switch him to meet my uh, bumper keys and stuff, um, I just haven't done anything with it. Oop. That was close. You go this way, sir. <laughs> it's awkward because that potion goes up. Hey, I'm not good at platformers. 
Interesting, the enemy gets hurt by the spikes too. Alright, okay, let's see if we do this correctly. How did I do that? Huh? How did I make the fire? Well, I made the fire slide. That's some tech for you. Killed it. There's a beam of light. I, I really need to remember that I have the uh, them on the bumpers now. Okay, I'm just gonna start using bumpers. Oh, you can just hit the switch with your body. There we go. Okay, bumpers. Remember, use bumpers. She moves up and down those little bumps. Interesting. I don't know why I'm collecting all this stuff, but I must. Okay, that opened the pathway, but there's more stuff to our right. I have a lime concentrator I like to put in my water. I ran out of lime. Now I only have, uh, what's it called? Lemon. But I jumped over that clearly. Explosives hurt him. I guess explosive counts as fire damage. That makes sense to me. It kind of sounds like my Discord notification sound that I have. I'm trying to change my Discord notification sound. Oh, 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 oh. Did these blow up? I wonder. <laughs> Killed. I have slain myself, and I have no one to blame but myself. <laughs> oh, lordy. Oh, that's an oopsie doodle. Oh, I can't hurt him with this. Lordy, dude, I'm so bad at these games. Don't make fun of me. I'm just bad.
trying, man. Okay. We're just gonna get up there. Drop this. Just like that. Except, you know, now we can't get hit the rest of the time. And we all know how I play. That's not gonna happen. Got him. Got him too. Or not. Fine. I would like to see some form of health recovery for people who are terrible like me. To switching the characters though at least right I get some credit some credit look at that And they seem to only come near you when you're on the same plane as them. So as long as you're above them or below them, they do not move. I wonder if that's going to have any effect on them. I almost fell right into this creature. points are for but you know I gotta I gotta collect sometimes your character goes upwards really fast uh, this is awkward Got it open, but we, we all know me. We all know that. Wait, I got my health back. Then I then I have one one health. I don't get my health back. Was someone paying attention? I was paying attention. I don't pay attention. I was hoping I would be able to do that. Interesting. The um. Explosive actually stops that. There we go. I'm starting to get used to the controls. I'm juking now, you know? Okay, I'm gonna go to Ninja Cat. Okay, we're back to the start. I should be good now. on his right side, right? And then we turn, it's on his left side. Oh, I don't want to go in. I wanted other stuff. Wait, how did I lose the health point? Mm -hmm. Not crazy, right? Oops. Right there. Okay, there's one switch already gone. Look at him schmoo, dude. Let's get up here. There we go. Collect this stuff.
I'm gonna run into one of those explosives one of these days. I already know it. I smell it. I taste it. I almost walked off down there to um, use a, another pet utility item, and I wouldn't die. See, look at that. I just baby tapped um, the jump key, and he went all the way up. All right, brother, I'm gonna need you to Both are off now. Oh, hello. I just comes at you. Star symbols. Hang on, I want to see this. I want to look at this more. Mr. Chicken, I'm gonna need you to move. Oh, I thought I was I could turn to hit him, but no, I was wrong. But we got our full health back now, at least, so we're all good. Never mind. I wish I could gently make a turn. Kinda, can I like gently do that with my keyboard? No. Like it makes a full character motion. There we go. Yeah, that's one of the things I wanted to say is you can't like baby tap, so it's not exactly precision. It'd be a lot better if I could stop making this input though. Moving. You can see my hesitation on which key, uh, where, which button I'm. Oh, Lordy. No one to blame but himself. Just like one pixel too high. Lordy, look at my downstairs neighbors just drop against the floor. Oh, probably himself. There we go, we'll just ignore the guy. We'll let him live. He's just enjoying his best life, you know, he's just existing. Okay, we're gonna get this. So if Kitty... So if the cat jumps in the water, is it just insta-kill? Because I think I had two health points then, right? We got the evil chicken that time that killed us. Oh, that's awkward. There we go, we got him. Lordy. It is an insta-kill. Okay, we're just gonna go to the right this time so I can check out what the stuff on the right is. Mind me, I'm just struggling. That'd be painful for people watching. Just like, man, this guy's really bad. Oh, yeah, really bad. Yeah. Alright, we're getting slightly better at that, though. Oh, wait, I can't go left first. That's right. <laughs> I knew that. I was saying, just, just testing your guys' memory. Because uh, apparently mine is not very good. Oh, 
Oh, I knew I was gonna run it. I called it. I smelled it. I called it. You who smelt it, dealt it. My cats love water. I used to live on a farm. We had a lot of outdoor kitties. And, man, they we had a bird bath and they would just go inside that bird bath and take a nap. They were weird. Come on, get in the hole. Get in the hole. That chicken's gonna be right below me, isn't it? No, chicken, you come back over this way. Okay, chicken's over to the right. Chicken died to the spikes. I ran into the spikes. Alright, just no dying, easy peasy. Wait, I'm being camped. Um, hmm. What are you... What are you supposed to do here? You're just trapped. There we go. What? He follows you? You see him? He was wave dashing on me, dude. He's going back and left and right super fast. Wave dashing. Oh. How did that die? Andy action. There we go. Easy peasy. And that should get him. Yeah, there we go. I'm saying I've been hit by that explosion plenty of times. There we go. There's nothing in here last time. Oh, this is not good. Hey, we got him. How do I... Okay, you can just explodify those. Gotcha. Oh, that's awkward. Hey, we got him. Hey, we got him. Okay. All right. Wait, now my health's full again. How do I get full health? Is it like every thousand points or something? Oh, I can't get the item. What's that? It'd be funny if like you could only have one cat get the item. I just wanted to check. All right, we got it, brother. We're schmoving. It's like, well, uh, level two? I'm slow. I think we've all discovered why I'm not a speedrunner. I'm so glad I was the correct cat. I was not paying attention. still hit me uh, when I was going in the portal. I just noticed that. Oh. Come on, spit it again. That was my fault. Can I stand on top of this water? No, you can't. Like, even though you're not touching the water technically, it still counts you as touching the water. Out. I 
I guess that's what the um, wavy lines signify, right? I should have figured that one out, but hey, we're learning. So we're getting better, getting better skills, you know? I guess that's enough of a gap for me to slip through. Okay, we still got it. Yeah, we're getting there. We're getting there, brother. We're getting there, brother. Hopefully no one heard that. I cracked my arm. Did I actually get that when I didn't mean to? I did. I didn't even know I had it. Okay, so those guys are easy enough to deal with as long as you get a uh, line of sight on them. Spam the button, there we go. We just go right up next to the chicken. Ooh, almost ran into it. See, there we go. I'm starting to learn distances. I'm starting to get there. I'm starting to understand. I'm starting to believe. control there we go there we go okay so fish gives you health. Took me a little little longer than I would like to admit to, to realize that. Fish gives you health. Ooh, I'm gonna that. I guess that's why up is bound. It's to get you off the wall faster. But I would rather just slide down slowly than act be accidentally up stick, you know? All right, let's try to do this. Oops. 
Oops. That. Yeah, you just run into that so easily. Wait, I'm down to one health again? What? No. Oh, I'm so afraid, man. So afraid. Ugh. So afraid. This is fear. Oh, that kills him in one hit. Okay, cool. But wasn't there two? Am I missing one? Or did I already get it and I wasn't paying attention? Oh, it's right here. Got it. We made it, man. We did it. I'm curious to see what level we're on. Okay, we're on level five. We're actually halfway done with the game. Okay, so that's a one-way gate. It's so funny, it's just like one pixel off. Oh. Now, the smart thing to be do would be just like kill myself here, probably. Ooh, that's dangerous. Wait, how do you get back down? How do you... Is that a trap? Alright, I gotta figure something out. Is there a way to get back down through that? Curious if it's a soft block. Is there a way to get through that? Only time. Let's... This is a soft lock. Yeah, because I don't perceive a way out of this. That's nasty, my dude.
Well, don't let yourself get soft locked, I guess. The chickens are blocked by the bomb. Soft luck, say. Here from Georgia. Ooh, that's such a hard bait up there. Is there a way to get down past those? I pressed every key on my keyboard for it. Or at least a fair whack of my keys, you know? Hold up. Okay, there must be a way to get past it then. Unless I missed a thing. Is there a way to get past this? Oh, you can press down. Okay. Okay, how did I do that? How did I do that? Okay, so it's not a soft lock. Never mind. Okay, so you have to press... You can only do that with the white cat. That was not explained anywhere. No, you can do it with him too. Can you not do it with this guy? Yeah, okay, so if you hold down and then press jump, it'll make your character go downwards like that. Okay, so there you go. At my expense, you have discovered. I'll grab the key on the way back, or I'll grab the key now. that thing we're gonna kill that one guy i'm getting revenge for uh that thing i considered a soft lock all right let's get revenge for what i considered that soft lock now i know i have the i have the knowledge i have the technology we have the research upgrades we're good to go We got it unlocked. We got it on the down low. Gotcha, sucker. Alright, get dead, idiot. Okay, he walked into it. That's his own fault. I'm so afraid of falling in that water. Lordy. I can just do this. I'm dumb. <laughs> Alright, laser is off. And we got the fruit. Give me my imaginary points that mean probably nothing. A 
I'll split the distance one of these times. Got him. Oh, I got that. Wait. Um, what? Am I missing something here? But I... can't. Um... Am I missing something? Uh, brother, I can't swap cats. Is there a way to get the water out of here? Missing something. Because if I swap, I just die. No, I'd be missing something. Okay, what have we missed? We made it past the laser. anything. So how do you get past that? Hmm. Nothing here because we have the switch flip. Hmm. Yeah, there's nothing here. Yeah, and you can't switch underwater. Uh, this is a hard lock. Or not, not hard lock. Um, well, it's not a soft lock because it prevents progression. What would you call this? Is this a soft lock? Because the game does not let you progress. Yeah, I can't switch cats underwater, even if I'm trying. Um, hmm. Well, I guess that's the end of the video. <laughs> I was just going to beat the whole thing. But, um, no, I'm completely 100% stuck. I do hope my window capture is capturing everything. I noticed I got some other lines that are all around my screen, so hopefully I caught everything. Okay, well, we'll give uh, thoughts here. All right, so what do I think of the game? It definitely has a few different things that could be worked out, but we'll go over the positives first, and then once the positive section is done, uh, I'll timestamp like the negative, so I'll, I'll give two different timestamps there. I'll say like the positive timestamps and the negative timestamps. So if you don't want to hear the negatives, you can just click off the video after that, of course, yeah? Okay, so the good ones. I like the nice shaded aspect of the game where you have the movable and interactable objects in the game with a black outline on them. I really do appreciate that as it makes it much more simplified into what you can touch and interact with. And then stuff that is not with the black outline, like this tree, for example, uh, you know you can't interact with it because it is not, I'm going to call it cell shaded. And uh, it took me a little longer than I expected to, you know, figure out how the heart system works, but the collectible uh, anchovy or fish or whatever that is to give you a heart back is nice because it is quite easy to get hit in this game. I like the idle animations and all that characters being able to 
and they move. It's kind of it's kind of very fluid in that regards. There was some would be some modifications I would personally make to, the, to such a thing though. Um, I would like to see the movement kind of pulled back in a little bit because that's kind of a big movement. During those really, really fast up and downs, you had to be basically right next to them. And it was kind of hard to do that when your movement swings you basically an entire character length to the left or right. Oh, right, throat, right, this must be positive. We have the cat, you know, that can smell what the rock is cooking over here. He's got the, uh, the eyebrow raise. And he's a pyromaniac, which I figure all cats would be if they could use matches. And then we have the bomber cat who does the job. I like the bomb animation. It's very nice. It's very clean. And the enemies are fine to combat against. You know, there's no big issue there at all, which is good. Uh, mainly because the bomber cat can crouch. There was a few enemies I was going up against where I was a bit worried that uh, I wasn't gonna be able to clear them, but then I discovered you can crouch while placing the bombs as the bomber cat, so everything worked out just fine. Oh so, yeah. And then the, the soundtrack is, it's nice and pleasant in the background. It's not too obtrusive, because that's usually my problem with like the, like, maybe platforming games, and they might have a soundtrack that kind of annoys you after a while. This one's nice, it's in the background, and I didn't really notice it. I say that as a good thing, not a bad thing. Because when I'm playing a game and I don't really notice the music in the background, I'm okay with that. Because I would much rather it blend into the background of the game than to be something obnoxious. So, bonus points for me on that. I appreciate it when the soundtrack isn't in your face. Alright, and now we're going to go into a negative section here. All right, negative timestamp 5855. So what do I dislike about this game? So, the dislikes about this game, of course, are the control scheme, the default control scheme for the game. And I'm not going to sugarcoat this. It is awful. You use arrow keys to move, Z and X for jump and attack, and then one, two, three for switching. There was a lot of situations where you had to do rapid swapping of characters in order to get stuff done. Now, if you're used to playing MMOs, you're going to have no problem hitting the 1, 2, 3, and the Z and X keys, because that's what you do in MMOs, like, really rapidly. But 1, 2, 3, and Z and X are really far away with each, from each other. I mean, that's, that's basically a full finger length away. Especially, like, if, let's say you're someone with tiny hands, you're not going to be able to hit those very fluidly. Uh, my suggestion for a fix on that would be to, to take the one, two, three keys, pull them down to ASD, and then you can leave the other controls as is. I think that would be okay. But people could just do what I did. I just used a controller and then set it up specifically to play this game because I used you know, the big picture mode and set my controller up just to play the game. Uh, two. Uh, my brother, you're gonna have to fix this soft lock right here. I see no perceivable way to progress past this point. Perhaps it was just an accident. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and leave a review or community hub or some sort of discussion post thing that will make the developer aware of it if he doesn't watch this video, which, you know, I don't expect he might, but you never know. Was, uh, honestly, I wanted to finish this whole game in just one clean one, or one fell swoop for the video here, but I will not get to see what is past this. All right, what else? Um, I think that's about it for the negatives, honestly. Uh, I think the movement it could be pulled in a little bit or restrained a little bit, fix this soft lock here, and then. Maybe during tutorial I'll explain to the player that there is in fact a down key that only works with the first two cats. Because I thought I was softlocked previously. But I was wrong. But yeah, that's I think that's about it. Oh no, well uh, one more, one more thing. One more thing. I watched too much Jackie Chan Adventures growing up. Uh there needs to be an option menu. Like, um, 
when you play a game, you need to have some sort of volume mixer just so you can turn down the game without having to turn down your system volume or using the volume mixer outside of the game. That's maybe just a personal preference there, but it is really nice to see. And uh, it's easy to do. It, it only takes a, a few lines of code and you're good to go. And make sure if you do do it, uh, you base it on log 10. I believe that's the default is log 10. Oh, that should cover it. I mean, for a $2 game, I think overall the developer did a pretty decent job. It's about 20 cents. That works to be, what, 20 cents a level or something like that? And uh, that's A-OK -okay with me. And with the with the, how are the levels set up and everything, there is easily a way that they could add in a fourth cat if they wanted to with more levels. It's like a little, you know, buckaroonie DLC or something like that. And uh, all in all, not a bad $2 game. So if you like um, kind of short, lightweight platforming games, it might not be a bad thing to pick up for $2 once he fixes this, or she, once they fix this uh, soft lock right in front of me. Or maybe this isn't a soft lock and I'm just big dumb, which is a possibility. So let me know in the comments below if I just have big dumb here. Alright, I will see you guys in whatever I post next. Peace!